past the Makerere gate. I see the cars trying to move. It's time for me to move. Look at the traffic right here. The Makerere Hill Road, and at this moment, it crosses the Sa Apolo Kawa. So the city center is the other side, and this is where we are going to cross from. This is me in Mengo, and today I'm going to be taking you around. These are just random tours, random city tours of the places you'd want to see. So make sure you stick around, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications. Let's go. So I'm going to be taking you along Bali to my road. We may end up in Makerere or somewhere in Wandegea. And just opposite down there, that is the Kabaka's or the Kingdom of Buganda's administration block. That is the one, it is Bulange Mengo, and we are currently still on the Albert Cook Road. This is the one, it comes from the other side down in Namirembe, and it goes straight like this, past Mengo Hospital. So the road we are taking is this one right here. And allow me, cross from somewhere here, because it's a bit safe. That one continues up to down Kabusu or even Natete. So this is how we are going. Remember to like this video, subscribe to the channel. Most of the buildings right here are old buildings that have been here for some good years. Well, there are some new ones, but most of them are old, like th that one up there. It's an edged building, you can see the designs. So the other road down is called St. Emma Road. And for us, we are going to use Balintuma Road. The other one down is St. Emma Road, it's currently under construction. Maybe one of these days, I'll bring you there and show it to you up to around Kasubi. We've uploaded a video of Kasubi recently so you can as well check it out and when I do that one you'll be clicking with it let me hope so it's kind of safe to cross from here and let me do it this is still Balintuma Road and we have just started the Balintuma Road that's helped me like the video, subscribe to the channel. And by the way, this is still part of Kampala. And as we are still going, that is the road that links you to the Mengo Hospital. And that's not where we are focusing today. We are on this very road. Any memories with the road? Just let me know. But I'm here to take you along with me. Around here there is a university, Kaiwa International University, and there are several hostels around here where the university students stay. And the road this other side looks relatively better. Than some of the roads in the city. What do you think guys? Drop a comment. Let me know what you think about the road this other side. Only that the walkways have not been worked upon. But you can clearly see that this stomach has been here for some time. And this is part of Mengo. Let me try to double my speeds. This is part of Mengo.
just help me like the video subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications of course as usual a lot of structures are coming up that is a new structure and you can clearly see they are still building and setting things Uganda Protestant Medical Bureau somewhere down here ECL Pharmacy open 24-7 so also somewhere here you can look at the structures the buildings edged ones then GMS hospital services I think it is something like Gombe Gombe medical S services this is where they have their their offices or their main branch so the hill up there is Namirembe hill or where Namirembe church is the protestant church that's where it is up maybe i'll find time and go there one day and show it to you now this other part of the tarmac was recently fixed and people here are playing basketball most of them are Sudanese in the night most of them are Sudanese I was still saying that most of this tarmac, the tarmac this other side has just been was recently replaced because it was in its worst state and at the moment it's a good place to navigate it makes a good shortcut as you're coming from the sides of Mengo heading towards Nansana, Kasubi and either Makerere those other sites For the trees in Kampala, I think we shouldn't say a thing about them. They are something normal when it comes to Kampala trees. People have planted different tree species. That is the Acacia tree. You can clearly see. And many others. Those are the ones that keep Kampala cool. That give us the coolest area around town. Others plant flowers, but of course, even those flowers are important. That is Evans Hospital, not Ivan's Hospital. I've said Evans Hospital. Green everywhere, trees everywhere. So when it comes to trees, we don't have to be scared of anything. Kampala has enough, enough trees. That's what I've been telling you, that these structures are old enough. This one is the Namirembe Christian Fellowship. Kaiwa. Where Kaiwa International is. Kaiwa International University is somewhere around here. And... 
the Namirembe church you use the other road I'm going to be showing it to you one of the oldest churches around Uganda or in Uganda Namirembe road the Namirembe hill up the other side and we are crossing from somewhere here it's kind of busy you don't have to just cross otherwise end up being knocked down so let's continue those other neighborhoods but we are continuing to this way and around here this is where Okel A does it say it is spoken like that Okel A extreme hotel that's where it is you need to check it out one of the best around Kampala and it has two branches one is along the um, somewhere behind after Chagwe Road you just need to check it out I've ever been there we once had a meeting just there Yes, I'm just looking at things the way you are looking at them. But the journey continues. Oh, that is the church infrastructure, all the church land. And you can see the structures that are there. Edge structures. Let's keep going. Remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and then turn on the notifications. The guy I've just bypassed, those are some of the guys that move around the city collecting bottles. Of course, companies, all bottling companies have not put in more efforts to collect these bottles. They just produce more. We need them to at least produce less and make sure the ones released into the people are recycled and reused, which will limit on, on the effects of plastic onto the environment or onto the soil, the soil. What do you think, guys? That's what I think. Look at these palm trees. Wow, wow. These ones are big and the other ones are small. I don't know what difference these things have. These ones are big. The other ones are small but tall. Which simply means they are old. Anywho, let's go. Let's continue. Prince Kayondo clothes. That one over there. So this is also the home of the rich you find them this way and by the way this road just right here links us up to somewhere in Nankulabi so keep around let's keep grinding and see where it all ends 
someone wanted to know how they can help my channel the various ways you can help my channel one of them is through the super stickers and the super chats you see where the like button is then there is a share button then there is that dollar sign in a heart you can tap that the different prices of you can send to me and it's connected straight to the mobile money so you can go and tap there once you tap there there is a chance of you sending me money and that way you have supported me the other ways you can support the channel is by watching the adverts and not forgetting also sending me money via all of those remittances through the number that I put I always put in all my videos it is 0780 99 88 37 that is my number it is in my names anything you want to drop please drop it on those numbers and let's continue so guys we are approaching the Nankulabie area at the traffic lights shortly after Bukesa for the people that watched yesterday's video that was the tour and we are coming from up the other side heading to this other side if you haven't liked the video please do and if you haven't subscribed to the channel do it as well because you lose nothing by doing it it's the road to three thousand subscribers so you can clearly see we are going to continue with this road we are coming from Motesa 2 road and we are heading to what one day yeah, we have used the other road with the other road in the previous video that is the road from the city center towards Kasu which is called the Hoima road we have used that so we are going to use a different road today and it takes us up to Makerere just stick around and let's go together So I'm going, I'm not going to cross from the middle, no. I'm going to attack the lights from somewhere here in front of the cars. Because here it is easy to cross. Look at this border border guy. So here it is easy to cross and I'm going to cross from somewhere here. Let's go. So we are heading towards that road takes to Hoi, Hoima towards Hoima or Kasubi and Nasana. So I have showed you the other in the other video, the previous video, I explained more about that. So let's go this other side and the bush you see, or the forest you see in front there. That is Makerere. And at the moment, that's where we are heading towards Makerere and Red Sweet. The other one was the was the Balintuma road it ends around there on the traffic lights and at the moment we are attacking the Makele, Makerere Hill road this is the one so let me use here in the middle and take you there hopefully you have already subscribed to the channel turned on the notifications get notified just in case I drop any other videos or you can drop a comment and let me know what you want to watch on the channel. The other one is the Nankulabi market. And this sound here is still Nankulabi. So this is the one. Let's move and I'm going to use this middle island. Oh, the, this island in the road until somewhere down there. Because here it gives you greater views. The road is nice. And everything is okay. The road is two lanes. And a bit okay than the previous one. 
we have covered in this very video what do you think guys any comments anything you want to say drop it down in the comment section let me know what you think i think it's time i get off the road and cross from somewhere here you just need to continue otherwise the moment you stop your chances of being knocked are very high so there are more like i've told you the other side there are more also more university students in these neighborhoods just because of Makerere, the biggest university in Uganda, it's over there. That environment where you see the bush, that is the one. And maybe one day, one time, I'll be taking you there. I'm going to be linking with one of the, of the students, a friend that is a student, and we get there explore it guys this is called the Makerere Hill Road And at the lights, it crosses the Sa Apolo Kawa Road. So just stick around. Let me take you. Your job is one to watch, two like, three drop a comment, four sharing with the people you think they would like this. If you're if you're a Ugandan that is abroad and have one who is also abroad, share the, share this video with them. You never know; they may be lacking something like this to connect with the home. I've got many messages, Stella. Stella told me that these videos connect her with home. She has been away for quite some time, but when she watches the channel, she connects easily with home. So please do it. And remember to like the video and also subscribe to the channel. That's all I can say. My work is one, to have it uploaded onto the channel and edited. Of course, I don't need so much edits. No, I always leave it raw. No music, no nothing. I always leave it like that. So this is Sa Apolo Kagua. You can call these lights the Sa Apolo Kagua traffic lights. And the road we are covering is still the, the Makerere Hill Road. And at this moment, it crosses the Sa Apolo Kagua, which is coming from the other side and takes this other side. So all the land that you see before me, that is the Makele University land. So the city center is the other side. And this is where we are going to cross from. And I think it is safe to do so. But then when you reach around here, it's also safe to stop. kind of messy at the traffic lights the border border guys spoil everything 
let's go so we've come from the other side down and we are heading towards the Makerere Hill Road and the next other part that we are going to reach that is the Makerere main gate around Ham Towers Makerere and the traffic jam here is intense just help me like the video subscribe to the channel that is the fence of Makerere and for those that don't know that that roadside that is before us is the no parking sign now you do so i'm finding the best way i don't just want to film people that's why i have to dodge them all the time this is the makerere neighborhood still the makerere hill road any memories with the area drop them in the comment section let me know if there is no any memory just let me know that you like the video if you do and if you have problems with the video please advise accordingly and I know I will change but as far as I know Everything is kawa. Everything is okay. The traffic is tense. Just shortly after the traffic lights. Let me use this other side. Let me use the island. And I'm very sure I'm not thinking a bad picture of my country, no. If this part wasn't around, I'm saying this one, the one I'm using at the moment. I want to let you know that many people, many of the cars would be flocking or crossing to the other lane such that they can get wherever they want to get faster. Thank God it's there. They have to be patient, waiting for the others until the road clears. That's where they will go. Otherwise, help me like this video. It may be longer than usual, but I guess it will be worth it. The traffic here is serious very very serious and also so let me cross and go back we are still going Makerere Hill Road and it is very possible that the people we are encountering are students coming from school after their lessons and you never know I'm just speculating who knows let's continue and before us there that is the Ham Towers Makerere owned by the city tycoon Hamis Chugundu who own several businesses like the Ham Ham Villas. Um, there is the Ham Shopping Grounds. There is also the Hana Schools. There is the currently being renovated Nachivubo Stadium. Of course, he is the one developing it. So we all I would say that it's under him at the moment until he's done the work and many other businesses in the city also the brothers are doing well when it comes to business or the renting business 
let's continue so it seems this traffic jam is tight like this up to around one day gear you see the lights have opened but there is nothing going on no car moving because maybe there is something that has stopped the cars either a faulty car on the road who knows So there is traffic also from the Gaddafi Road. Gaddafi Road comes from the other side down. Where Dayeri was It comes from the other side down. So traffic from the other side and the one from the Sa Apollo Kagwa Road is what is disturbing around here. And the Gaddafi Mosque is the other side. So along the Gaddafi Mosque, that road is called Gaddafi Road. Let's go. Now imagine someone that has to do a delivery and they are in this traffic jam. That's where services are given. Either a star or no star because of the delays. And in a few meters, we shall be at the main gate of Makerere. And this is the Ham Shopping Grounds in Makerere. Chichi. Katobiri mo. Someone trying to run away from the camera as if they are being pointed at with a gun, which is not the fact. So this is the main gate of Makerere. Of course there are several other gates, but this is the one, the mainest. And you see all those cars? Students coming from school. So we have the cars coming from down the Apollo Kagwa Road. We have the cars that are coming from down the, the Gaddafi Road and also the ones that are coming from this other side. Past the Makerere gate, I see the cars trying to move. Hopefully, it doesn't stop there. It continues. More students down, waiting for cars, public cars to take them, the taxi. So we are approaching one day there and that's where we shall be ending this video hopefully you've learned a thing or you've enjoyed it and if you've enjoyed it please give it a like before it ends and also remember subscribe to the channel turn on the notifications for more let me take this shot here and after taking the shot i think it's time for me to move Look at the traffic right here. So I guess it's either the traffic lights down aren't working or the traffic police officers messed with the cars, with the car movement. And that's what is happening at the moment. One of the two is supposed to be right. True. The traffic lights are off and whenever they are off just know it's going to be messy and at the moment they are off so the traffic police officers have to do it manually like they don't know the number of cars coming from the other side or the other side so that is the problem at the moment so the road down continues to Mulago and this way takes to the city center then the other one takes to Kawempe and the likes I think this is where I'm going to end hopefully you liked the video subscribe to the channel as well 
and turn on the notifications. So over there, that is the police. The Wandegea Police Division. And the Wandegea Market is somewhere here. They are paving it. So I am going to end here. That is the road to Kawempe. Yeah, road to Mulago and the road to the city center over that side. That is a new building. It is Haji Musa Mall. And the other road down is called Haji Musa Kasule Road. So I'm ending here. Till the next video, I am out. Peace.